Welcome back to Bari News Kenya. This is where we give you the latest updates in Kenya and around the world. Deputy President of the Republic of Kenya, Rigathi Gashago, finally responded to critics after claiming Kenya has tigers. Deputy President Rigathi Gashago on Monday defended himself from a barrage of criticism from Kenyans, questioning why he had told the world that Kenya has tigers across its expansive wildlife reserves. Speaking during the International Federation of Red Cross and Red Crescent Societies Pan-African Conference at Nairobi Hotel, Gashagwa addressed the issue by attributing it to a slip of the tongue to his native Kikuyu language. He humorously clarified that he had actually meant to refer to leopards as the Kikuyu community often uses the same word to refer to the two wild animals and I quote from his statement. Some of us, when we are speaking, think in our mother tongue and then translate into English. So in Kikuyu, land where I come from, the leopard and tiger are one and the same. End of quote. Gashago made the remarks during his working tour of Colombia on Friday last week. During a meeting with political and business leaders from the South American nation, the deputy president humored the foreigners by describing Kenya's vibrant tourism and wildlife sector in a cheeky way. The second in command also welcomed them to visit Kenya and see tigers and other wild animals across various national parks. However, his remarks did not sit well with the Kenyans who questioned his knowledge of the country's tourism t sector. A large section of Kenyans remarked that his comments were not factual and did not represent the true picture on the ground. Notably, African countries are not known to have tigers. They are primarily found in Asian countries such as Bangladesh, India, Thailand, China, Russia, and Indonesia. Unfortunately, tigers are staring at the threat of extinction with only around 5,000 remaining worldwide, as reported by World wildlife fund that is known as WWF. Meanwhile, Gashago was the second leader to spark a debate about the wildlife in Kenya. President William Ruto previously made headlines in July when he encouraged tourists to visit Lamu and witness the unique sight of swimming lions. And I quote from his statement, how many have seen lions swimming? If you want to see swimming lions, go to Lamu. There is a spot where lions swim, end of quote. Following the remarks, tourists flocked to Lamu to see the unique sight for themselves. However, they were left utterly disappointed. One of the tour guides at the region complained that foreigners frequenting the region were only interested in the swimming lions and were largely disinterested in other activities. Ojang Odero, Bahari News, Kenya.